everyone. Today we will learn about the planets in our solar system. Woohoo! We'll meet new friends and have lots of fun along the way. Are you ready to play together? Let's do this! Cheese. Wait, that isn't right. There's something on the other side. I wonder why. I think it's a puzzle. So, you need to put the puzzle pieces together to make a picture. Ooh, I love puzzles, but this piece won't fit. This goes in the middle. There, now it fits perfectly. It's our solar system. Look, Mr. Spaceman is coming to visit us. He's an astronaut. And he knows a lot about outer space. Mr. Spaceman, can you help us finish the puzzle? It looks like you're still missing the planets. Really? What should we do then? Let's find them! That's the spirit! Here's a special heart covered in decals. A kitty on a rocket. The planet Earth. And the moon. It's so cool! Hmm, the heart is made of Play-Doh. Maybe there's something inside. Squish, squish! Oh, I feel something. It's dark brown and round like a ball. What if it's one of our planets? I'll clean it off for a closer look. It's Mercury, the smallest planet in the solar system. I can move it with my space wagon. Do you know where it belongs, friends? I'll show you! That's what Mercury looks like in real life! Mercury is a very hot planet. It's too hot to live on. And that's because it's the closest planet to the sun. That means it belongs in this hole right here, right next to the sun. Now we need another planet. It'll go right here. Maybe it'll be in this winter wonderland somewhere. Where should we look first? Could it be inside that present? Maybe not. Aha, a straw, but what should I do with it? Oh, I know. You can use it to blow away all that snow. Maybe the planet is underneath. Blow, blow, blow. Go away, snow. It's working, friends. I see something now. It's another planet. What planet comes after Mercury? I bet Mr. Spaceman knows. Let's ask him. Do you know which planet this one is? It's Venus, the second planet in the solar system. And this is what it looks like. It looks scary. Even though Mercury is closest to the sun, Venus is much hotter. In fact, it is the hottest planet in our solar system. Let's put it in its place. Be careful. When it rains on Venus, it rains acid. It would eat right through your raincoat. What do you know about Venus? It's so bright that we can see it from Earth. <laughs> oh, that's right, Emily. Now we need a planet for this hole. But which planet is next? That's easy. Earth. Yes, high five, friend. This looks like a lovely green meadow covered in flowers. Now we simply have to dig to find planet Earth. <laughs> this will be fun! Is the planet under these flowers? Nope, not here. I think we have to dig in the middle. Hmm, nothing yet. Will we ever find the planet? Wait, I think I see something. Did you see it, friends? Look closely. It's a big blue ball. I guess we found it. I'm so glad you helped me. Let's take a closer look. Planet Earth is blue and green in color. The blue is the water, and the green is the land. Well done. Earth is the third planet from the sun. And it's the only planet that has people living on it. And I know that Earth has existed for more than four billion years. That's a long time! Yes! Wow! This is how it looks from space! Some people call Earth a big blue marble. That's because it looks like one from outer space. You go right over here. See? The Earth is now right after Venus. Hooray! I can move it the rest of the way. There you go. Uh, no, it doesn't go there at all. Oopsie. I think I need help. You're so close, Amy. Got it. Wee! Is it too late for me to play with you? I'd love to learn more about the solar system, too. What planet is next? We're looking for the fourth planet. It has to be hidden around here somewhere. Help us find it. I'll use my magic words. Abracadabra, bim bam wam. Whoa, he's flying so high, and he doesn't even need a rocket. Woohoo, I can see almost everything from up here. 
my, what an odd little place. The trees are silver and the animals look so strange. Maybe one of these bizarre animals will help us. Oh, we can't help. Sorry. But we can give you a clue or two. Look for the rock that isn't a rock. <laughs> what does that mean? I'm so confused. Boo-hoo. Don't give up. You'll find it. Just smoosh, smoosh, smoosh. <laughs> I can do that. Abraka smoosh. That was fun. But there's no planet here. Let's see. Smoosh. Hmm, not here either. I wonder if it's in that one. Smoosh. Nope. Where should I jump next? You're going to be here all day that way. Hurry up. <laughs> this is harder than it looks. And there are so many silver stones to choose from. I'll try the big one. Okay. One, two, three. Smoosh, smoosh, smoosh. Ah, there was nothing inside. This is frustrating. I'll never find it. I just want to give up. Ugh. It's just for fun. There's no need to take it too seriously. <laughs> You're right, my odd friend. I'll keep going. Never give up. Keep trying until you succeed. Hmm. Try that one over there. I think it's the one, Daddy Pig. Thank you, Emily. Here goes nothing. One, two, three. Geronimo, smoosh. Whoa, I fell. Did I find it? There's definitely something inside. I'll open it and see. Oh, this is just like opening a birthday present. I hope it is the planet we were looking for. One more layer to go and there it is. We did it! We found Mars. And it's the fourth planet from the sun. We are doing so great! Mars has two moons! And it takes 300 days to get there from Earth. This is what it looks like! It's stunning to see! I'll put it into the fourth hole. So, what planet is next? Maybe I can help. I found something for you. I was driving by the beach when a giant pink meteor fell from the sky. There's something inside. Great. I'll open the top of your Jeep to reach it. Ooh, it's so sticky. It's hard to get it out of the Jeep. Friends, let's see what's hiding inside. I'll push the gloppy gloop to the sides. There's the next planet. Ugh, but now the thick gloppy gloop is sticking to my fingers. That's better. Hmm, but what planet is it? Mr. Spaceman, maybe you know the answer? Here's a hint. This is the biggest planet in the solar system. And it comes after Mars. But I can't remember its name. Well, this giant planet is called Jupiter. Ooh, it's the prettiest planet I've ever seen. I'll move it into its proper place right over here. Let me help. It looks extremely heavy. There. Now we have to find the planet for this hole. To do that, I'll dig through this bowl of quirky bits and baubles. It's an alien in a spaceship. And here's a bright yellow planet. Dig, diggity, dig. Gloop, gloop. Squishing these is so much fun. I could play with these all day. Bloop, plop. <laughs> Just a few more. Bloop, bloop. Okay, let's get back to looking. Found it. Oh, this one is very different. It's not like the other planets. Is this even a planet, Mr. Spaceman? Of course it is. And it's the sixth planet from the sun. It's called Saturn. It's surrounded by beautiful rings. I see the rings. It's even prettier than Jupiter. You can't stand on Saturn because it's made of gas. It's ready for its home. Here you go, Saturn. We're almost done, friends. There are only two planets left for us to find. That means we must look even harder now. Yeah. Yum! Look at all those delicious treats. I'm so hungry. I think our next planet is in here somewhere. Is it this one? No, that's a slice of cake. This one is round. Nah, it's another type of cake. This is just a cupcake. Aha! This is big and round and blue. It's not a delicious treat, so it must be our planet. Yes, you found it. I'm so proud of you. So, what is this particular planet called? Let's go find out. Mr. Spaceman, we have the next planet. It feels very cold. That's only because it's so far from the sun. Yikes! My hands are all tingly from the cold. Well, this special planet is mostly made of ice. Ice cream? I love ice cream. Let me try some. No, it's made of ice, not ice cream, silly. Its name is Uranus, and it's a very cold place. It even looks super cold in real life. We are at the finish line, friends. 
We have one planet left to find. And something tells me we should look over there. Elsa is sleeping, and we don't want to wake her up. Her bathtub is filled with ice. So, the next planet is also very cold. Is someone there? Whoa! That made me scared. Let's remove one ice cube at a time. I know there is a cold planet in here somewhere. It could be inside an ice cube. Hmm? Nope. I hope no one is messing up my ice bath. That's the last ice cube, and there is the planet! It's even colder than Uranus. Brr. Mr. Spaceman? Hello? Wake up for a big surprise! Huh? What? Oh, welcome back. Did you find it? Ta-da! Here's the last planet we need! Neptune. It's blue because of all the ice on its surface! And that's all the planets in our solar system. This is Mercury. And Venus. Our beloved Earth. Then there's Mars. A giant Jupiter. Saturn with its rings. Uranus. And finally, Neptune. That was so much fun! Hit like and subscribe for more adventures. Bye-bye for now.